Hello Knight here, welcome back to my Roma Serectum campaign, playing as Rome. Just need to do this to load up the script. I assume that's done it. Yeah, okay. Uh, we're just going to check out... I've got a lot of public order problems at the moment. 75... <clears throat> Yeah, we really need to get some more cash, to be honest. Um, how are we going to do that? Orders. Let's Move out. first. Let's speed things up, actually. Or it will take forever. <laughs> okay. Um, what are we going to do with this guy? I don't think we've got anyone in here. Oh, we have. Okay. General! General! Imperator! Forward! Okay, that's still that's still actually fine. General, can we move up to here? Maybe not. Maybe we'll have to move to here. Move up. Prepare and to ambush. Imperator, move him up to here. Forward. Woof. Good lord. This bloke is so badly General. disliked. Um, right, well, I was going to use him as a general to move up here. We'll have a look at that in a second. Uh, let's just have a see. Forward. Yeah, Ready it just ambush. makes it so much better, the public order. Actually, we need to do so. I think I was building a another stove-throwing thing down here, which we, we've got to cancel, to be honest. We can't afford to do that. We need to spend some money on public order buildings, because we just can't move troops out of here at the moment. 10% happiness bonus. I think we need to do that down here in Bicor as well. We can, if there's anything that we can build. 10% law. Okay, let's go for that. <coughs> About here. We're actually building something here, which is fine, because we want to try and release uh, Scipio if we can. I think we tried to move a general around, yeah, we got caught here by some free people. Um, the free folk. Okay, so, probably we can't move very much out of here. Let's try moving all of it, and then we'll see what we can... So we can move back. I did say I was going to be a bit more passive, but <laughs> I'm not actually doing that, am I? I'm, being more aggressive, General. if anything, to be honest. Imperator, Let's see what this does. Leaving the army. Not much. 50%. Um, Sir. Sir. Leaving the army. Hmm. 55, so that's only giving us two Sir. for every two guys who move in. Um, Imperator. Right, okay, what we're going to do, what we're going to do. General. Orders. It's more cav, I think. Leaving the army. Still 55. General. Okay, try some more troops. Orders. Orders. Splitting the troops. Is it the actual infantry that's doing the good good stuff? 60%. It might be Orders. that we're gonna put infantry in. Orders. Splitting the troops! 60. Gosh, this is... Uh, we're going to have to practically put the whole lot back Order. in, I think. General! Splitting the troops! 65. Orders! Oof. Um, Orders! Leaving the army! It's still out of order. 65. We're going to have to put everyone back in, I think. General! Which is a pain. Sir! Leaving the army. Yep. General. General. Leaving the army. Oh dear. It's causing it would like nobody. Sir. <laughs> Leaving the army. It's just about under control. Seventy-five. That's terrible. Sir. Right. Okay. So can we pick up anything from over here? Let's move this guy to... Because we're going to try and attack this huge Cimbrian city. Uh, let's move to here. Move out. 
and let's move everyone out of here again and then put stuff back in as and when we can. Move out. So there's nothing. Orders. Nerva's a pretty good general as well, actually, I think. Move him back Leaving in. The army. Forward. And Imperator. some of the general. weaker troops Order. in with him. Imperator. See what that does. Imperator. Oh, 90, that's fine. That's not too bad at all, actually. Orders. So, in fact, they will join him. Oh, him. There we go. Right. It's not a fantastic army, is it? We've got a little boss that has to join them. Make it worthwhile making the attack. Um, General. Got some cav. We don't need any more cav. We need some heavy infantry, I think, and bowmen. So, send a first cohort. General Imperator. General. It's actually not too bad. This is actually in reasonable nick. Low taxation. I Ibura Durham is not bad at all, actually. We can probably... We've got to be careful of um, attacks. General. Let's send some more. Right, so we don't have much in the way of heavy infantry. Um... Imperator. Could probably afford to send that Leaving back. Could take army. some more heavy infantry out. out. Um, right. See, this guy is not up to much. This guy is not up to much. Sir. Orders. Um, I think we may need. See, what I'm looking at doing is we Imperator. need some. Imperator. Hmm. Imperator. This guy can go in here. Leaving the army. Now we're going to bring up some General. of these guys. Spar some spear troops. We still don't have many. And uh, even some of the troops we've got are fairly. Imperator. You have suffered quite a few losses. Okay. Right, okay, well this General. army here is going to head up here. Onward. Might be a mistake, Move might not be a mistake, sir. we'll have to see. I haven't really got much in the way of intelligence around here, to be honest. Uh, can he move? He can't move, that guy. Okay, we're going to come back to this, I think. We're probably going to fight this. Uh, what can we move out of here? Imperator. What's the full stack? Imperator. Full stack. Imperator! Imperator! Right, so we've got four full stacks there, so we can maybe release some of these guys. Try and Move out. need to put Imperator. a general in there, definitely. Leaving the army! March! And some stingers. Definitely seems to be the Leaving infantry. Sixty percent. This infantry seem to have the best effect, Imperator. I think. General. Okay, let's try him in here. Leaving the army. We maybe put one more unit in. The okay, troops. and let's send Sir. these guys up to here. Forward. So we're trying to garrison the frontier here, Ibura Durham. I think Durham means fort, I think. I think Ibura means you, so that's you fort. Lug, I don't know what that is. Something lug fort. Imperator. Anyway, I think that's what it means. I come from Camel. Kamaladunum, which is uh, Colchester in Essex, so I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I do know something about um, this sort of period of history, about the Roman invasion, etc. of Britain. It's very big in Colchester. Um, anyway, what are we doing? What are we doing? It's enough talk. So we're okay here. We'll come back to this battle, I think. We're still pushing ahead. General. I don't know whether this is a good thing. We may have... Um, see, the Belgae are up here. They're kind of a bit of a buffer state. So if we take out this this city, the Belgae are kind of all the way to the north then of us. And we can maybe become allies with them? Who knows? 
Let's have a look. We've got our noble master, a guy down here. Let's start moving him back. Honor. What I like about this game is the fantastic amount of movement that guys can do. You are not going to take us that long to actually get to the Belgi. That's not possible, sir. That's not possible, sir. Out of moves. Yeah, he's out of moves. Okay, fair enough. I got that. Um, okay. Right. I think the ship's moving back. I think all these guys are Fleet moving ready. back. They don't have anything on board. Fleet ready! Fleet ready! Fleet ready! Fleet ready! Looks to me as if they can all get to here. Yes, Captain! Ready to sail! Aye, aye, Captain! Ready to sail! I don't want to... Yes, Tangle with the Ptolemaic fleet, I assume that it's huge, although we haven't seen yes, it at captain. all yet. Fleet ready. So, yes, captain. it's a little bit of a mystery. It yes, may captain. be... it's not quite as big as I thought it was. Fleet ready. Yes, captain. These ships are pretty good, so we can actually afford to move them individually Aye, like this. We don't, they don't yes, need captain. to sit together when they haven't got guys on board. I'm not quite sure why Set some of them can move really long distances and others can't. I mean, obviously they're different types of ship, but Set sail. this guy can get right aye up aye here. Out of move, sir. This aye is a, another good ship. Aye aye, captain. Well, let's keep up to here. Yes, I'll move these guys back, but I honestly don't think aye I'm going to be able captain. to afford any more armies for yes, quite a while, to be honest. Yes, captain. Out of I'm move, in a bit of a financial ready. situation yes, here. As the Empire's bigger, it's got harder to actually make it into a cash cow or get it to work properly. So it provides lots of... Um, I haven't got anyone on board here, these ships, have I? I don't think so. I don't think I've forgotten anything, have I? No, they're all waiting. So we'll put all our ships together. Okay, uh, see places like this, not happy. Not happy at all. But, what does that lose us? 400. I think we can afford that, I think. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at our financial situation. 18, nearly 19,000, so that's, that's fine. Okay, so hold in Iberia. Try to build up financially. Continue to advance, I think, in Gaul. Simbri are not going to accept um, peace with us. I, I just think it's very, very unlikely. Um, just gonna move these troops around a little bit. I've got rather a lot of cav in one army. That's still not a fantastic s fortress unit. Fortress garrison, I mean. But um, slightly better. We'll put one more unit in here, I think. Okay. Right, that's not too bad. Um, say Manus Ilius is not the kind of guy you want to have in charge of a fortress or a, a new garrison. Um, okay, that's okay. Sir, sir. All right, so we're going to move this way towards this city that we took ages ago and then lost. At your service. Need to find out what's going on. Moving. Got some free people. Moving. And he has got quite a few troops in there, but we've got this army here, Darryl. this army here, so let's see what we can do here. Move Darryl. them out. No, I knew we'd get um, public order problems with this. Onward. Okay, that's not too bad. It's not too bad. We could even retrain all these guys. I presume it's with... Um, I must have a... what's the word? large foundry so we can actually increase the how good they are their armor um, is that a good enough army to fight these guys remember they'll be they'll be Roman troops they will actually be Roman we're gonna we're gonna go for it we're gonna go around here move depleted sir we need to have this litho boss with us or the stone throwing thing let's go to here march we can almost besiege it. If we besiege it, they'll produce more units. So if we go to here, March. and then we'll take Orders. it out in the next turn. Imperator. Let's go to here. Move out. And then just goes there. I 
I hope this guy isn't going to try and bribe us because I'm not too sure these are fantastically loyal people. Oh, he is loyal. That's good. I couldn't Order. honestly, it's not something I considered to be honest. Honest. Resistance to bribe too. So he's pretty good as well actually, so I'm not too worried. Um, Imperator. Could give us a problem will be these. Yeah, I knew that, Order. but that's... Um, Let's look what we need to keep here. Sir, Let's keep the Valetes in there. The troops. Keep these guys moving March. forwards. Out of move, sir. March. We're going to here. We should really have attacked the port. Okay, that's us done, I think. I don't think there's anything else we want to do. I haven't got any more reds, I don't think. I have a quick look round. I don't think there's any seas that are red. Uh, in fact, most are green, which is good. Uh, now, it all depends whether we're going to fight this battle here or whether we're going to auto-resolve it. We could just keep the siege going at the moment. Okay, so we don't have any reds, which is good. Uh, and we're getting 20,000 next turn. Okay, and I was looking over here, wasn't I? I was trying to experiment here. I think someone advised Baxter Lopez, I think, advised me to go for... Yeah, I've still got 40%. Perhaps I need to make a client balance or something. I think once I've gone client wise. I can recruit these guys, spearmen. 612. I'll have to have a look. Balarak spear um, slingers might be quite handy to have. Okay, well let's let's stop faffing about. Let's end the turn and just see see what happens. Let's have a look up here. This is where I've probably risked things a little bit. So I'm gonna just watch here. Well saying that, um because I sent our spy this way, perhaps I should send him back the other way. Send him back this way, see if we can get moving. Get some information on what's over here. On my way. Okay, so he's got about half a stack in there, probably half a stack there. So he's got about a stack of troops coming down. He could besiege Memphis, I think. Just about, I think. And probably with these guys, he could. But we should, in theory, Imperial. I mean, these guys, we've got three Order. three legions here coming through General. the desert. Once we've taken Paratonium, we should be able to. Well, we'll have to take out these guys as well, the free people. Can't leave them behind. There's an assassin here, god damn it. Clyde to Arxus. Uh, okay, well let's let's just uh, let's keep an eye as we were doing over here on Gaul. And let's just see what happens. So I'm quite worried that I might have pushed him too far into Gaul. That's if it's still actually Cimbrian. I haven't my intelligence is so poor. Oh there we go. There's an army come down, but not much. Send us elections. So we need to move all our guys into... Ah, that's bad. That's very bad. 40%. Right. Low, and if we get something quick, quick and dirty. Is there something we can build? Two turns, that's not good. One turn. 5% happiness. I don't even know what that does to us, it's so complex. Um, Patient growth or something. Wow. I think we need to repair these. If we repair these, I think we'll be alright. Hills bonus. I think. They crept up on us. How did that suddenly happen? And the Roman rebels, that's bad news for us. Some new members. Where is he? Over here, okay. Okay, end of turn report. 20,000. That's good, that's good. Although we've only got three. Okay, um... Right, do we destroy this guy and move on? Or do we just move around him? I don't think that's enough to trouble these guys or these guys, I don't think. Um, 
This guy wasn't attacked, which really surprises me. Move out. Ambush in place. I mean, it's a bit mysterious. Orders. General! Move out. Okay, so Waiting this guy has to stay. Orders! March! Prepare to ambush! Imperator! Don't really know why I moved that March. guy down, to be honest. Imperator! Think probably. We're trying to move him up here. March! Forward! Prepare to ambush! Forward! No more moves, sir! Not yet, we can't release you yet, Scipio. Maybe never. I'm not sure that we'll be able to. So we need to build stuff again. Over there blue. Or yellow, definitely. If there's something yellow, we definitely need to do something. 15%. We might be able to get something slightly better than that. Temple of Juno is one turn, it's 5% boost straight away. That gives 10 for 15, so I think quicker. Temple of Juno. Temple of Juno is the way to go, I think. Temple of Juno. Shrine of Juno. I keep saying temple, but shrine. What is this? That's the way to go, actually. Costs more, but um, it's definitely the way to go. So, building something here. Here. New Mantia we need to do as well. Again, 15% happiness. There's just no low losses on that at all, so it's definitely worth doing. We need to do something here because we're going to lose this soon if we don't. Because this guy's 94. I can't see him lasting much longer. Uh, because building something, that's building something. That's building a port. I wonder why I chose a port. Uh, again, that's 20%. Arsa. Let's take the taxes down a bit. Uh, that's basically our money gone. There's not really anything else I can do in um, here. What we need to do, I think, is move round. I think I've decided that I'm going to move round and we'll, we'll see if we can attack here. It's a slight risk. Let's see if we can see what's in there. Uh, not much. He's got a reinforcing army, but we're going to take Ribact by the look of that in a turn. That'll help us financially. Pretty much strong there, I think. Good situation. Oh gosh, not, not here. Still got another turn. Hmm. What does that give us? 10%. So if we can just last one more turn without it revolting. It doesn't say it's in revolt at the moment. And no signs of dissent in this settlement. I think we may be okay. We might be okay. I've really got to decide what I'm doing here. So we don't wait. Oh no, it's only four turns. We could probably wait. We can wait this out. Sir. I keep saying about not expanding too quickly Sir. and developing the economy. So we're going to wait Sir. this out. Sir. That's what I've decided. And this, this is weird. This single unit here, which is very, very depleted, as you can see, is seems to be holding up a whole Cimbrian army. If the army comes down, we'll have to attack it. That Cimbrian army. I don't have much intelligence, but as a way to cope, cope with that is to build a spy. Because the spies are so expensive, that's the problem. That's the problem we have. Aye, Captain. Right, let's just bring all the aye, aye, ships Captain. up to here. Aye, These are actually costing us a fortune, yes, of course. Fleet ready. Yes, um, and we're only using to ready transport to people at the moment. Yes, Captain. Fleet ready. Okay, and they're all individual admirals, and I've no way of joining them together, unfortunately. Can't see any bad things around here in the way of what oh, Crotona that needs to be. It's already on low. No signs of trouble. Can't see any uh, what am I talking about? Free people or rebels? No rebels. Down here was a problem, wasn't it? It's only 70%. Only whether to do it the other way around.
we'll do this first. It gives us ten percent boost, so it brings it up to eighty. Um, these are okay, so we've got oh, that's Sigga, isn't? Let's pull that taxation down just to make sure it's green. And still building a port here. I'm on low taxation. Right. Okay. Okay, we're building something there. That's good. These two have just been chugging away for ages. They're very happy. Not, not kind of having any problems with them at all. Okay, so we've got a battle up here that we're going to be able to fight. Sir. So I think we'll probably take that battle. And this one here. Oh gosh, it's red now. Why is that? Oh dear. Um, I don't really know what to do, to be honest. <laughs> it's, um, it's a mystery as to why it's so so poorly um, General. so poorly thought of. Orders. Well, we can move. Let's see if we move this guy around. Move out. It's moving up to Forward. here. Let's move the army that has no general out. I'm not quite sure where we're going to move him. Let's move Orders. this guy in. That's better. Now we've got a governor. We can actually retrain most of this army if we had any money. We could um, put them all so that they're in uh, quite high weapons and shields. Oh, he's got a stack. Not a stack. A few guys there. Your Honor. Let's have a look further up here. I think we can probably take that army out. I think we really can. I think I'm quite tempted to go and attack that. We can put together an army, which I think we can. This one will attack here. Let's go just stay there at the moment, I think, and we'll move it forwards. I think we can take this army. They've got good troops, but in an open field battle I think we can defeat them. But anyway, let's... um. Let's go for this sir. first. Attack! Besieging settlement, sir! Actually the walls are already damaged. Which is interesting. Well, let's just assault. Should be able to do it straight away because we've got a horsa. Wow. It's got loads of troops, but they're all in very, very few numbers. Um Yep. This is obviously they've been fighting for ages up here against the Embelgi. This is such a good game. Look at some of these units, the Bear Warriors. Wow, recruitment cost two thousand six hundred and forty-two. General Alaric, there's one unit of heavy spearmen coming in to help them. So apart from the fact that he's got 449, they're kind of like really tiny units, but very, very good. When these were up to strength, this would have been a really difficult battle. In fact, I, I doubt that we could have beaten them, to be honest. He is... what is he? Simbra tribe who made the home in Simbric, Prinsler, Monde, Jutland. Okay, so they're kind of like, well, like mm, Angles, I suppose, or Danes. Adopting the words from them and also taking names from their Celtic names. Germanic tribe made a number of immigrations throughout the history. In 111 BC, a large band were left southeast by turned back by the Boy and Volcay tribes in the area. Driven into modern Hungary, they were then turned back by the savages of Scordisi. Haven't had much luck, have they? It looks as if they then tried going to Rome. Anyone who wants to pause this and read it, they're welcome to. I'm just going to move on. Hasty, passionate, honest. He's a pretty good general, actually. He's only got two stars. He's quite young. He's a night fighter, so it's no puss. He's spotted by Manius Ilius. Nobody. Right, okay. Well, it even says that we've got three to one. Okay, well, I think I'll probably fight this in the next episode. It's, it's going to take quite a long time to take this city if I take it carefully. I don't, as you know, I don't want to lose too many troops. There's a good... Um, He's got a good 700, well nearly, nearly 700 troops that we're going to have to face. 
So we're going to take a few losses, but I want to keep them down to the minimum if I can. Okay, thanks for your time watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. We, we spent a lot of time uh, not doing very much, it might have seen, but we spent a lot of time also setting up things like this. Waiting for this guy to come down, this army. If it comes down, we'll certainly destroy it. And also, of course, over here. Oh, we need to go there. Just over here, we're in good position now to actually attack um, Paratonium. He's going to have a lot of troops here. There'll be quite high value ones as well. I think because it's a Roman rebel, there'll be. Um, we've had the Marius reform, so I suspect that they will be fully like legionaries. I don't think they'll they'll be rubbish. We're definitely going to take out Tigranes, and then we can maybe. There's not much coming down the road, so we might be able to take Tanis, which I think was their capital or their new capital. Um, yeah, so things are looking up actually. I'm, I'm, I'm much more happier about this uh, campaign in Egypt. I think we've got a very good chance of taking out the whole of Egypt. And this looks okay as well. We might have to... No, we'll probably just sit in here and see what this army does. If it goes raiding, we'll have to kill it. Okay, thanks for your time watching. So, speak to you very soon. Take care. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.